Hey guys, welcome back to some more AFK Arena. Today we're over on the wishlist account. We have 34, or excuse me, 2,400 diamonds. I'm not gonna be able to do any summons there, but as you can see, guys, we have farmed up a crazy amount of hero essence. So I went through the Light Bearer Tower. I also went through the Mauler Tower, got a lot of essence out of there. In addition, we did get some time emblems. We have 42 Stargazer Scrolls, which of course, those came from the tower. So I am at a point where I wanna put a lot more focus on Liberto with those 42 um. Stargazer Scrolls and really building out her in the entirety. You can see we also picked up some more common scrolls. Going through and building out the heroes, we have five elite hero stones. And again, tower farming, guys, really pays off. Here we get a copy of Leofric. So it looks like that is not our first one. Rest of these heroes are just going to be food. Now here, Superb Elite Stone gives us a copy of Brutus. And then we have three more copies of elite heroes right here. I'm hoping with the summons we're gonna to do today, guys, that we're gonna be able to build up these heroes quite a bit higher. Um, even out of here, I got 24 rare cards, so I have enough food in here. We need one copy of Palmer right in here. That'll be able to bring him up. Now, of course, we do need additional copies or food for Nakaruru um, or N Naruko. Um, that way we can build her up. So again, I'm hoping I can get a little bit more food out of here to build that up. Then, of course, everybody else, we just need food. We are still kind of crazy. We got Mishka built up a little bit higher, but I'm actually going to be building out Nevi on this account. Then, of course, we already have our five Graveborn heroes, including the Awakened version of Shamira that we're building. And then Liberto, we need one more to go Legendary Plus on that. So let's get into the summons, guys. Still, fingers crossed, we're using all the summons that we can get out of here. And there is an Elite, and it is a copy of Trishia. So pretty happy with that one, guys. Um, I believe we already have one star on Trishia, but as we continue to build these heroes out, it just gets additional copies and gets more expensive, essentially to build them out. Most of the heroes we have gotten to the point where um, we're needing red chests. So we got a lot to the plus 10 signature items. We got a lot to the plus 20 signature items. So we are getting to the point where we just need to build them out. So Liberta, we get a copy right off the bat, guys. And we get a light bearer scroll. That could be Palmer that we're looking for. So that will take him to Legendary Plus. We need two copies. And those two copies will actually take him up to Mythic, which would be amazing to see as we continue farming here, guys. Not only that, guys, the resources that they're giving us out of here is phenomenal. I'm going to save the rest of my scrolls in here again as we continue to build them out. We have three chances here, guys. Three chances for Shamira. I'm wondering if we can get anything. I would love to see some diamonds, but I would love to see Shamira as well. One, two, three just gives us some more resources, which again, not too disappointed with because we got a copy of Trishia and that actually takes her to one. That actually does add our first star in there, which of course unlocks the engraving. Now for the engraving mats, I need more. And again, at this point, we're gonna be saving some of our resources for um, Liberta because we need two more copies and that will take him up to Mythic meaning that we can add the signature item on there. Then, of course, we do have Rem still looking to build up a lot of these heroes. Now, the Oaken, I don't think we have enough for a summon, and we do not, guys, but I did a summon earlier because we actually got Mishka built out here a little bit, and then we also did add Rem in here. So we added two pieces of Rem's furniture. So again, as we continue to build those heroes out. Now, Beast Ground, again, we've been doing this every single day, guys, that we're going through and we're doing our summons in here getting a lot more beasts, getting a lot more return on the secret spices. And like I was saying, within the King's Tower, guys, we pushed, and I believe Brutus said it down, we pushed 59 floors in here today. So kind of crazy to think with Naruko, um, exactly how strong she is in here, 51 or 59 floors. Um, the Light Bear Tower, we pushed our full 60, I believe. Um, we were right around there. Now, when it comes to Celestial and when it comes to the Inferno Fortress, Getting to the point of being able to, in World Tree, we're going to be able to make a lot of progression in there. But we've gotten to the point within the Resonating Crystal, guys, that we can actually put more heroes. This, of course, was our stopping point. I was going through and swapping out heroes as fast as I can. But now looking at our build right here, guys, we have five Light Bearers. And again, based on being able to put them in the Resonating Crystal, um, we have five Maulers right here. We do have, what, three, and one of those is, of course, one that we're leveling, but we do have three. We can have enough slots for two more, and the Greyborn, of course, we have five, and then we have Shamir and the Resonating Crystal as well, so we're pretty well poised for building up these heroes, guys, as we continue our progression in here. 
once the new tower is open or once the wilder tower is open, we're gonna be able to put some more in here. And again, with Nevi, we need some more copies. And I'm wondering if we have enough food for Nevi because we have one right there. See, we have Tamaris in here. Um, we don't have enough because Tassie, you know what? I'm probably not gonna use Tassie, but thinking of Tassie for the tower, um, cause we could take Nevi up to that legendary plus. Let me pop open all these chests guys and see what we got out of here. We only got one. There's another 5,000 essence, which is kind of crazy. Could it be Palmer guys? It is Jerome. So we get an unlock rate right there from Jerome, which again, not, not too sad about that guys. Jerome is still a pretty solid hero in there. Then of course, um, a copy of Hogan. Again, red chests were up to 14 and we we're focusing on building out Rem. Already at 27, but not enough to take her any further at this point. So hoping to get, again, a little bit more furniture kind of built on her. And then, of course, a couple other heroes. Guys, we, we can make some progression. We're still on 31-4. And again, this has been kind of the pausing point for a while. But I feel like we're at a point that we can start making a lot more progression in there. Which, again, looking at the events, looking at everything we have going on. Um, definitely can some, make some more progression now. Vault of Time, of course, done. New Beasts are done. Um, Treasure Scramble is pretty well done. Temple Rift, we hit two teams. I stopped at the two-team aspect so we can actually level this up a little bit and get this a little bit higher. So I'm just waiting to get Trade Enhancer a little bit higher. But we stopped once we hit two teams. Um, still, again, hoping that pretty soon we're going to be able to um, be able to make a little bit more progression in that game mode. And then again, I feel like 31-4 that we can go through and we can actually make some more or start making more progression in there. Now, with that being said, we can take our first hero, boom, up to a 240. That is right, guys. We have a couple in here. Now, Damon, you know what? I'm going to go for Oren. And the reason being, I want to utilize him um, within the Wilder Tower. Again, there is our second 240. So we only have three more heroes. So we need Essence for three more heroes. And then everyone will go to 240. Then, of course, we can take them far beyond that 240. Shamira, we already have a couple more copies of. So we are very, very close, guys, to really unleashing the true nature of this account. And again, guys, looking at our plus 20, plus 10, plus 20, plus 10, we're, we're taking them to 10s and 20s. And I'm systematically going through here and actually building out all these heroes. Um, yeah, we, we could definitely take a couple more heroes, again, based on our wish list that we're kind of breaking down and getting them built up a little bit further. And I feel like a couple like building Scarlet up a little bit higher, but again, we're building out Rem right now. And then going through all of these different game modes, we have just made a lot of progression. I know we, we finished out a ton of progression at the very beginning. Now this I've actually been resetting. And the reason for that is getting not only the amplifying emblems, but we're getting a little bit more of our essence right here, but also getting these guys, getting our elemental shards. I believe we're building out Oren right now. If I remember correctly, he's at 29. We just need a little bit more. We'll be able to build him out. We need, what, another less than 100 shards, but that will take him to a 30, plus getting him to level 240. Again, we're going to be able to crush the tower. We're absolutely going to be able to crush the tower with having him built, guys, which is super, super cool to see. Um, Definitely going to make some more progression. Now, I've been running through and swapping out all of my gear. I just dropped all my gear off of all of my um, Mauler heroes because they were done for the day. And then, of course, we have this tower coming up tomorrow and then the conjunction with some of the other towers. And look at the heroes I've pulled. So the only hero that we've actually summoned is Liberta in here. All of these other heroes were just from stones or from regular summons. The exact same here, guys. We have gotten, what, one, two, three, and then double copies here, four and five. And again, those are just heroes that we have pulled out of stones or that we have pulled... Um, out of events, which I don't think we had any events that actually had any of those heroes. So we're already at 10,000 essence again. Just need what, 40, 80, 120, about 110, possibly less essence as we continue to make progression in here. And we are making progression, guys. I give it a couple more days. We'll be able to crush through 31 once we get a little bit level, um, a, a little bit higher on the levels. And then we'll be able to make, again, a lot of progression in here. All right, guys, so that'll do it for today's video. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. And as always, thank you guys for watching.